shot. Here comes the team. Team Red, one, two, three, four. Brad. And there he is, Brad! King of the crossbow! You missed it so much. <laughs> Have a seat. I'm feeling pretty good now that I won. Glad to still be in the competition. I have no ill feelings towards my red team. I mean, they're still my teammates, and I look forward to coming back and beating the blue team with them tomorrow. I'm like a cockroach, man. <laughs> keep, keep coming back. You're a cockroach. Bad, bad weed. Come on in, guys. So far, you guys have used rifles, pistols, and the longbow. Well, today we're gonna test a skill that applies to any weapon from any era, judgment. A true marksman can recognize a threat and know exactly what to do in the split second before pulling the trigger. In the real world, these decisions mean the difference between hitting a friend or foe. You will be engaging certain targets while avoiding others. You won't know which ones until the last moment. Because this skill is so important for modern marksmen, you'll be using the AR-15, the civilian version of the primary infantry rifle used by the US military today. We've invited Craig Sawyer back. Craig's an expert with the AR and also with the real life tactics of Navy SEALs. He'll be here to assist you in preparing for the challenge. You're gonna have your back to the target. With this practice challenge, they'll be faced with friendly and enemy targets to engage. That is a loose representation of what a lot of our troops face in real world situations, especially with hostage rescue. You're gonna have black targets and you're gonna have white targets. I'll indicate to you which targets you're gonna engage. As soon as I tell you that color, you'll pivot, load the weapon, go hot. All right, let's get to it. First shooter. Shooter ready? Stand by. Black. White. Our military and law enforcement background should help because we have trained in decision-making drills. Black. Target identification, very vital. A bunch of my my blokes were killed in the first Gulf War um, from an air-ten attack. I screwed up in practice, and hopefully won't do that again. To watch this entire episode on Outdoor Channel, contact your TV provider today.